Did I tell you you can win a prize? Did I even explain to you that you can win a prize? Oh my gosh, this is the time. The festive season is the season to win, win, win. But I'm hopefully by the way, as I any other time is Pokwa Christmas. But that's not the point. The point is, <laughs> we have something to give away. And all you have to do is tell us all the drama programs that run on a white 254 currently. All the drama programs that run on white 54 currently. And you holla at us at white 54 on Facebook y254 channel on a twitter and y254 underscore channel on instagram one more time please anyway speedway at y254 facebook y254 channel on twitter hashtag there's no hashtag there at y254 underscore channel on instagram so please do tell us all the drama programs that are airing on a y254 so that we can give you something to give you no not to give you the festive feeling, but just, you know, I mean, you've been with us all year and you've been amazing. So might as well. So no, Mineto Val or at Kalami Val. And it's that time to have that kind of conversation. And we have a question on our socials that is Facebook at Y254. And we are asking you something about adornment. How are you feeling about it? <laughs> Let me introduce my panelists first before we get to your comments or we get to emphasize that please just go over there and do like you. Okay. Saseni. What's your name? I'm Evelyn Nobiam. Thank you. But where are you on socials or what are your handles? My handle is Evelyn Nobiam. Mm -hmm. Able to Facebook, um, Facebook Instagram. Evelyn in Kenya, mm -hmm. Instagram, the model Evelyn. Mm, I knew, yeah. I knew when you made to lay up, I'm sure to get up on her photos. Hey, to go to Sumboa town, Cynthia. They are for the model. I think dog or the Kustia. Pause on. I'm a cast of his happy and Christmas. You may answer to the little mango like this. Aki guy, who misses Christmas clothes? I miss. <laughs> I miss. Mom, so funny. <laughs> I'm, I'm on my zeka sana. Please introduce yourself. I'm um, Sevia Mulaku. Uh, social media handles is Sevia Maestro Mula. Maestro to mean best. Hey. So I'm the best. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. What do you think about guys who pierce themselves? Sevia. Because <laughs> So what do you think about guys who have piercings? Um, I think when it comes to piercing, mm -hmm. I am able to judge because I'm wondering when I pierce me, I need to pierce you. Because uh, and, and I think to 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 diversify his story, he could idea my dem. Na patizingira my dem ona ras pierce to machine ona pierce kumi. So for me, I'm not comfortable with a guy who is piercing. Na mi mi the first instance ni kwa na me pierce you're a gay. Why so, now? I'll always judge you. And then uh, ini kitu to me ona from the uh, wale wa European League. Isi ni matabi o metro maju. Sisi kama wa Kenya, sisi kama wa Africa ona pierce ni. We will always judge. Naskia ku kumbia joke mbae. Kama yo joke ni kujibu. Una piece nini? That is supposed to be the question. This joke is very bad guys. But I really want to say it. I'm trying to figure out if I should. Vile ya boma yenga liva yo kitu. Nani yo vile? <laughs> so I would repeat it, thank God. Yeah. Why are you at 254 Facebook, 254 channel, auto the hashtag is why in the morning. What do you think about guys who have tattoos? Ah. Piercings. Okay, to me, uh, I can say like sometimes it's a fashion mm -hmm. on my side, mm -hmm. and someone can do it for fashion, but others like when I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to to the society. Mm -hmm. So, as for me, I'm actually against them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because uh -huh. I only see ill picture Missouri. Because mm -hmm. about to na juma na ume, afa iko na any place ko mulia kia me, ame kile izo my earrings. To na na kila time ina kuangani was chan most of the time. Na pia to me bila semanga all ampendi wanume akona nywele. Just na kwa ona benyam na kunywa kunywa apa na marasta. 
ni uongo ama ni kweli is it true is it not true wala la me to interject something interject explain to me mwanaume akijidunga mahali what does it portray when it comes to fashion okay kwangu as a model mwanaume akijiweka hizo pin kuna wenye wanajaribu ku advertise what they are doing like unaweza pata mtu wako na industry fulani ya hizo vitu mm-hmm. so akikuja on board anaonyesha hizo vitu zinafaa kuwekwa wapi unafaa kujiona tu mtu tu kwa karatasi <laughs> na weke kwa hiyo mlango yake na aseme hii ndio kitu nafanya uh, unaona kila mtu sasa hizi tukiangalia kila mtu aki advertise kitu mm-hmm. utaona wame design iko kwa poster mm-hmm. utaiangalia pale one oh ni so and so lakini sasa ukikuja on board unataka kuonyesha ile kitu unafanya mm-hmm lazima tu utafanya kitu kadogo tu atakuwa mwili mtu aone nikiweka hapa inafaa iwekwe place fulani it sounds like mm-hmm. brand ambassador yeah, yeah. situation safe yeah. attack you <laughs> attacki na attacki na attacki <laughs> mtu amejidunga dunga siji hapa siji hapa siji umeka mapete kwa mikono huko what are those <laughs> Utaanza. Utali wako nao umeona venye amejenga zote. Sasa hapo umemjudge pia na yeye. Kaa tukaambugibu exe bi natural. Tutakutambua. Because those are funny. Unajua hizi vitu ni upbringing. Kama wewe umekuwa abroad your lifestyle utagototoni, you've grown up you've gone to high school, campus, hustle yako. You've not done hujafanya hizi vitu zote. Now you come to the perception of the life at siku hizo kitaka brandi lazima uanze na wewe. No. Kama wewe uko na values zako, you still have customers. Does that mean people who pay stone, guys who pay stone have values? totally to me cuz mimi nikilelewa i never saw any guy pace mm-hmm. so i can't pace mm-hmm. you see hata wewe labda as a as a as a, as a girl uliona wewe uki uh, uki uki grow up mm-hmm. labda mama yako alikuwa ameweka pace kwa masikio mm-hmm. but sasa umeona watu wameanza kuweka tumbo mm-hmm. ulimi sasa una what is that ulimi sasa ukidunga utakula aje kwani shimo inatoa nini <laughs> why are you thinking like that how you <laughs> ungali gani moto <laughs> Kwani hata piece hapo unaona supu itapitia hapo kabla okay, hiyo na hiyo kitu ikirust huko kwa ulimi. Uh, <laughs> Your concerns are very strange. <laughs> Abu help me again understand. Yes. Why are you against it again outside the model industry? Okay, according to the society mali tunaishi. Mm-hmm. Si kila mtu ana ata accept ile kitu anafanya. Like say unasikia say tukileta judgment tutasema men are not supposed to peers any part of their body you know mm. that is according to the society so tukifanya vitu pia na just society inatuangalia yes me i want to brand myself that man want to brand himself but the society on the other side wakuna hiyo conflict unaona like vile my brother amesema sasa hizi mm-hmm. aki grow up kwao maybe akuwa yona mtu amejitoboa masikio mm. that is queen sindio but uki step outside queen lazima utamit na different things eh? so i'm not saying that ukitaka kufanya kitu lazima you brand yourself ujidunge dunge but now ina come hiyo industry mali huko ina depend wewe unataka ku send message gani to your people to, to your viewers because as a perception as a model yeah. mimi maybe nikifanya modeling yangu i'm not doing it for the community i'm doing it because that is something i'm talented in and nataka kufika place fulani for example you as a journalist eh? mm-hmm. suko hapa unafanya kazi you send your message to the community mm-hmm. as well as unafanya ile kitu ulikuwa unafurahia ndani yako this mm-hmm. is what i want to be mm-hmm. so ukiona mwanaume pia amejidunga dunga i'm not saying like kila mtu mwenye anaifanya aka kwa modeling industry but most of them me wenye nimekutana na wao na wapata pale kwa hiyo industry mm-hmm. so ata these team really engage na one of them cuz i were, i was really disturbed niliona <laughs> amejidunga kila mahali hadi huko ameweka hizo pete zote everything ah. so it's like nikamuliza mbona uko hivi mm-hmm. mbona umeweka hizi vitu zote mm-hmm. akaniambia i'm doing this to brand myself mm-hmm. nothing more cuz watu wengi wanaona those are gays do what I do interact with gays most of the time because in that industry uta meet kila mtu mm-hmm. and uh, from Maybe the best shwa. of your it, model, it be, knowledge it is better to, <laughs> just, to, to evaluate the term brand just a minute I <laughs> don't understand this branding ya kujidunga no i'm not saying that kama unafanya hiyo lazima ujidunge but kuna vile wewe unaweza approach your business 
like me nikitaka kwa unique we have a lot of models eh? mm -hmm. but when i want to be unique i have to do something which is unique what do you do hmm? to stand out <laughs> what do you do? like for me as a designer mm -hmm. if i want to stand out nita create ile ngo yenye najua nikisimama pale itaonyesha like Hakuna mwenye amitengeneza before mm -hmm. something unique unaona but so you know that pia you doing it based on values right of course so you see so but when you... sometimes mm -hmm. uwezi tengeneza nguo ju unataka the community waone hiyo nguo iko decent what what unakuja na ile brand yako yenye ukisimama mahali wanasema hiyo brand is from Evelyn Odhiambo mm -hmm. it's totally different from Nato designers totally different from Kony designers so unakuja na ile brand yako so most of these men when you are jikatakata masikio wapi wapi <laughs> <But> <laughs> do, you feel, do, do you feel as in brand yourself do you feel you're not infringing the other person cuz mimi ukijidunga dunga au feel sitakuwa comfortable na wewe even as you come to your brand na umejidunga dunga i think i want to be comfortable kana wewe kwa sababu niko na perception this one is not straight it is a perception i already have so why can't you exclude yourself from kujidunga dunga cuz i think sometimes pia e branding inafaa ikuwe ina commodity kila mtu kidi brand nafa mm -hmm. feel okay even if i'm not taking anything from your side I'm able to check it out, you see. But sasa ukijidunga dunga na ina ni fridge, si I'll exclude myself from you. Now it depends. Nataka tu utoe hiyo mind ya mwanaume amejidunga dunga, ye ni gay. Ama ye si jini. Nilisikia ukiongea hiyo ya kwanza. So najaribu kutoa hiyo mind yako. We don't do things for you to be comfortable. Nani yako kwa fashion industry for you to be comfortable? Unasikia kupitia makofi. People are there to make business, to make money. That's why I ask you, is your business, does it have economic values? It depends. So if I'm selling these products za kuweka kwa hizi hearings, kila kitu, na nimekuja hapa kwa isho, nimejidunga dunga nimezieka, first nitakuambia, unauna hii na ika kwa masikio. So nimekupia example. Hata before I explain to you, when you just see me utajua tu this girl anafanya this business mbona wendaki kupanda juu ya wanyama apande juu ya leo panda sema sasa hii ndio kazi nafanya eh see just put a poster so unaweka mnyama hapo unaweka kamba yako it's normal why you go to the extent of kujidunga dunga okay the flip side of our question before we get to at the meat to this conversation the flip side of the question is pia wanaume wame shuka shuka ni wale do you have a problem with that <laughs> Again, kikuangalia ujashuka tena. Sijashuka tena. Eh, na hata si ndio. Na hata wadau kukando wangu hawajashuka tena. Eh, eh. Nani wewe anataka kushuka nywele? Okay, okay. Sasa pia wewe msichana <laughs> seme babe nywele yangu ni mbaya. Eh, eh. pia tu seme babe nywele yangu ni mbaya. Kwanza naenda kwa dryer. How now? <laughs> And then sasa naonanga madem after 2 to 3 weeks mm -hmm. they want to exchange. Wewe pia wewe pia 2 to 3 weeks unatoa. Wacha 3 2. Haya, sasa kuoga. Wewe pia unafaa tu ile kitu kijifunika at maji sio tena. Anaeka juu. Ni mwanaume tu. Sorry, it's the way you're saying it, it's not what you're saying. How do you feel about it, guys with hair? Okay. Kwa wanaume ambao wanashuka nywele mm -hmm. ama sana sana kushuka kwa sababu dread ni kitu tumezoea kuona. Lakini mezoea wapi mau mau fighters. <laughs> na mseme mnapenda wanaume na washuka nywele. Usikose <laughs> kusema hiyo pia. Ehe. Uh -huh. Mimi kwangu sipendi mwanaume anashuka nywele. Why? Mm. Hii branding yako ni different. Unapenda watu wanajidunga dunga. Anashuka nywele. Why? Kwa sababu niko na reasons zangu. Mimi ni mwanamke, mimi hutengeneza nywele yangu. So mimi na expect kwa na ule mwanaume decent enough. Si mwenye niko kwa fashion industry, yes. But nataka yule mwanaume mwenye afanye zile ambazo pia mimi nafanya pale. Unajua watu wanajuana. Hmm. So ukipata mwanaume mwenye yako that decent iko sawa kwangu. Lakini on the other hand, hmm. siwezi sema mwanaume afai kushuka nywele. Mm -hmm. Kwa sababu hakuna mali imesemekana ati mwanaume anafaa kunyoa. Ati mm -hmm. eh lazima anywe nywele. Mhm. Mm mwanaume pia kuna zile vitu zenyu yeye mwenye anapenda. Mm -hmm. Sasa ukijekelea pale ati mwanaume lazima afanye hivi tunawa kazi ya life on the other hand mm -hmm. so mtu anajiachilia afanye ile kitu ye anapenda mm -hmm. akiona ameshuka na look nice is okay mm -hmm. akinyoa anaona ako sawa is okay cuz hivyo ndo ye anataka mm -hmm. unaona uwezi ambia mtu usifanye hivi like for instance saizi uanze kuambia dem mm -hmm. ati wewe unafaa kunyoa dem atakuambia zi sifai nyoe lakini mtu mwingine ataona mbebe mm. niza kuwa poa kinyo mm. ama kiweka wig ama kishuka kuna kaunti nimeenda hakuna msana kukua na nywele 
kila mtu hadi niliuza huko i love sasa mimi nimeenda hadi nimeshuka pusi sasa huko tunafaa kunywa si wote ama form ni gani but okay continue yeah yeah so kwangu mwanangu mwenye nashuka kwake yeye akutu sawa not for me mimi mwenye nezataka ni yule mwenye ajashuka nywele cause pia naangalia the community on my side so na on the other side ni utaambia nini watu Yaani kwako ni utaambia nini watu? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Lakini kwa upande mwingine pia tufai ku look down sana tunasema ati mwanaume anafaa kuwa tu hivi. Mm -hmm. Kuna changes zinaoka. Mm -hmm. Mtu anizaamua tu mimi nataka kushuka nywele. Haimaanishi ati yeye yeah, anafanya kitu yenye haifanyika. Kila kitu yenye unaona this time ile renye tuko ilifanywa kitambo. Mm -hmm. So tukiona sasa hii is not a news. Mm -hmm. Ni kwa wale tu wenye maybe Sevia na Ashwa tena. Kuna jo hiyo kitambo hiyo kitambo huko. We have to be factual. Hiyo kitambo huko. Wewe uliona mtu ameshika ni. Eh. eh? According to my research. I, I think uh, that's why I said we we, we are society to transfer kwa based on our values. Mm -hmm. So uh, ni vibaya sana. You have not seen even your father ameshuka. Mhm. Mm Wewe umeshuka. Mtoto wako akishuka you are complaining. But sia tu ushayo na babako akisag I'm sure at some point uli teremsha suruali kijaribu ku it was done mm. but you didn't see your dad do that but why are you cherry picking things <laughs> at least kuona yeye pia kuona why did you do it yeah. be serious why um from on this side I'm going to support uh, the type of hairstyle wana maana zaeka ka dreadi na kubalika wewe labda ni rastafara ama maybe you are playing soccer yani kufurishe you can always run free you see but kuna nyingine sasa val siji umeshuka lights siji mm -hmm. sasa siji ni nini unafanya mm -hmm. you see eh, for me bado nakataa mtu anashuka nywele mm -hmm. personally kwa sababu val mimi sikuona hizi vitu nikilelewa mm -hmm. i never saw any guy around me ameshuka nywele na sasa when you come Nairobi you want to tell me you don't have one friend who braids his hair what are dreadi ku braid Well, funny enough, these guys can never be my friends. Where's the sugar and the lemon, Mr. Ango? Ata ukwe ule o. Like even right, even if I have na like I, I always nilikuwa na moja mna jaribu sasa kufinya. Is is sugar sugar is. Eh, niliona ni kama mbele boss unakamba yendo tu hizo vitu. Na funny enough, after two weeks I didn't get to her. Because these things I think guys are it's trial and error. Kuna wana wana jaribu tu ati eh. Eh, but maybe some first in a kwanga mtu akwa idol, anaweka hizi vitu. In a kwanga mtu aliona labda kwa mtu mgeni na kapa poa. It is trial and error. Kwanga ati mtu ati so akona values that now I want to make my hair or something. No, sometimes people are just idol. Na wale mna kuna pesa mingi pia ina msubua, anaweka hizi vitu. Okay, all right. My next question is, do you think there's a certain age watu wanafaa kuweka hizi vitu? Yaani ukishafika 25 ufai ku PS PS tena like unafaa kuwa mwisho ama 25 hata ni mingi. Tuseme 18 19 hapo juu na juu kuja kujijua. <laughs> ama ukishafika 30 sasa ndio unaamua kushuka nywele ama kuweka. Au ufai kuweka lakini kama unakubaliwa kuweka, put it in campus. It's normal. Hiyo hiyo ni unasumbuliwa sumbuliwa na vitu mingi. Kama anataka saa hii. But when you are done saa hizi unafuta afute kazi. What about let's say? Akona kazi, akona mm. pesa. Mm. Sasa nataka dredi, mbona asiweke? Joya sasa and who is society? Who is this society? Who is society ni mimi na wewe. Ah, ah, well, well if today I wanted to bring the to your place. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. Wewe unanipenda sana. Mm -hmm. Na mimi nimeshuka nywele na unanipenda. Mm -hmm. But now uh, the end game is your parent is supposed to accept my dowry right mm -hmm. what about if your parent has me your guy is okay mm. but you are shuka nywele mm. sidhani kama ninaweza mkubali mm. weka unampenda endeni mm -hmm. but mimi kwangu sijamkubali mm -hmm. what what will you do bro nyo watu naweza grisha nywele tena it's not that serious just cut it mm -hmm. lipa mari mm -hmm. Kienda, sinyuele itendelea kumea. Then do what you want. I don't think that's that serious. It's not three rocket science. So I feel like you'll be accepting what your dad said, right? Because you feel it's the right thing to do in front of your parents. What you have said, what you have been referring to is your upbringing. So sini mpaka tu ni seme tu shukran mali ni metoka. Thank you for raising me. You know, I cannot just simply say, nye 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 <laughs> Then we go further. We are at when they majo. What about Mburo akatai kunywa? Sasa apo sasa wataongea na wazazi. Really. Is that that's a thing between them? 
But also okay. it's about wale watu wanashuka nywele mm. and they keep it so clean mm. and so fashionable. I I I, I always see like the diamond don't anga na ka nywele na kasawa. Ni pesa unaona ama ni nywele yake. Ndio nasema pia kama uko na pesa unakubali. Unajua hizi vitu ni pesa mingi. Kuna levels. Eh, unajua unaweza kuwa na pesa na nakatika hapo mbeleni ama umengangana ukaitafuta lakini unaenda kuisha. Mm -hmm. Na kuna ile kuwa na pesa 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 pesa. Inaitwa money. That's a bit unfair. Yaani tutai okay what do you think man? Okay kwangu sio ni kama kuna age mhm mm ya kuweka hizo vitu unataka kuniambia harmonize yeah. kange vizuri sasa mtu wa 60 years yeah. anaenda tu blow dry <laughs> kufanya nini sio kutengeneza na sasa kama kuna grandchild anaenda kunyolewa na yeye anaenda kushuka mbona rasta wakwenda all generations na uko sawa na hiyo mm. na wengine wasishuke that makes absolutely no sense it does not and we interrupted you i'm sorry ningoa tuombea sawa na mama anafaa kufanya vitu tu kampo kwenda chini ama wakikubalika is a problem mimi ninasema mwanaume anafaa kuwa mwanaume mm -hmm. akuwe yeye mm -hmm. asiangalie other side nasema ati lazima nifanye hii kwa sababu iko hivi na hivi kama wewe ulikuwa unapenda kutengeneza nywele ukiwa campus mm. be you si ulikuwa shule mm -hmm. na ulikuwa una meet na lecturers una meet na watu tofauti na ukuna hiyo nywele umetoka hiyo shule ukitoka shule bado fanya tu chenye unafanya don't change because of people eh? Just do whatever you want to do because hata ukijifanya sasa hizi ati kama mimi sasa hii nijifanye wewe mimi sitaki kushuka mm. itafika point na angalia hivi nasema eh nilikuwa nashuka acha tu nirudi nishu, mm. nishuke na kuna wenye wameniona hivi so ni tabia gani kwa mwanaume ati nilikuwa nashuka sasa si feel comfortable kwa sababu utaki mtu mwingine sijui akuone ulikuwa unafanya kitambo be who you are ukitaka kuweka hizo dread ukiwa 60 weka that is you But I think from a man point of view mm. like I think hata mimi nilifanya hizi vitu campus unachukua sabuni unazungusha zungusha nywele yako then una roll nayo maybe for a semester if, but ilikuja inaisha tu and you feel like eh hey, man what's happening to me if your parents did not have a certain view about nywele I did not even show it near my parents Sasa sikia juu ulikuwa unajua si ndio because you knew the reaction yes. what if they were liberal what would wake kwambia you know what kitana wewe fanya tu kile unataka bora tu nasoma na unafanya kile nafaa Ah uh, watu ni masimba hawezi fanya kitu kama hiyo But if it was the case then you would be a bit free imagine a whole family that has rasta na wazazi hawana na wana shida So But I think you, I think it atakuwa like we'll be bringing up a, a different generation. Utakuwa na impact wale wengine wadogo. Cuz mtu mdogo mtu mdogo na yake anafanya anataka pia kufanya. Atasema daddy niweke kama hiyo yako. Na ata grow na hiyo mentality. Why are you making I do, I'm not, I do not feel it. Si feel kama ni okay. Si feel kama ni okay. Because you were brought up to understand that mwanaume anafaa kukaa some type of way. But what if unge grow na hadi walami? But unaona vile pia hii kitu ni profession. Wewe sasa tuseme you are into fashion, you are into music. Mm -hmm. you, you are possibility likely to unakubaliwa kufanya hizi vitu. Mm -hmm. Basa ule mtu yeye ana grow, anakufuata. What about kama profession yake ni different? What about kama anataka kuwa daktari, mm -hmm. ama anataka kuwa journalist, ama anataka kuwa mtu mwingine? Do you feel utakuwa na impact na sio na impact akigrow akitengeneza nywele time ya kutafuta kazi? Cuz you see pia job, job seekers and job employers atakuwa anaangalia how you dress, okay? Akiona umeshuka nywele ukiingia kwa ofisi yake. Are you likely to get that job? Ini mentality ya kitambo. Sikuizi watu wako na rasta na nini. Hadi kuna mtoto alipelekana nini mahakamani at the school was telling her to cut her dreadlocks and she won by mm. CV. So that so, is social media pressure na alishinda juu ya social media <laughs> no, but in, if, if kama tuna agree that vitu za kitambo but it is one out of ten, not nine out of ten. hiyo ni tu yenye tumesikia. <laughs> so possibly there are things that are going on that we don't know. Uh, but uh. I My thought is not important. Yours is at <laughs> on Facebook quite for for channel on Twitter hashtag is why in the morning I hear we have something on our social media pages. So please do send in a penny of your no what sisi ndo tunaomba a penny for your thoughts. Yes. So do like you. I love under this to sahu sahu. All right. So Uh, here we go at white five four on Facebook. And man James, good morning. Says by the way, Leonard Kenrel be some songa man likuwa na ota. Na ota jibu sevia jo I think alikuwa be songa. But all, one thing I know for sure is, if you want and wait, if you want and willing any funny hairstyles, watch her. Ina mane na head yako. For instance, wale when your forehead, kuna hairstyles. Singira wale yako na kafani. Okay, I get you. So. We should be conscious of the hairstyles that we put based on our 
the shape of our face, I get you. Ata sisi wastana tunakuwa gana yu. Arik Ortiz says, I have cornrows but no piercings. It's just a person's choice. And it should be, le oh, I think he meant you should let it be. Okay, Kapolo Tam Tam watching from Texas. It's your lot code. Locked, show it on fire. 100. I see you and I appreciate you again. It's at White 54 on Facebook, Y254 channel on Twitter. Hashtag is Y in the morning. Keri Keri says, Nili jiposu alilenu jana. Ah, ah. Nam kunipa kitu wase. Oh, iyo nini. Oh, sweetie, no. It's not over yet. We have to keep it going for a couple of days. Iyo, I think tunapena next week. So please, in fact, now that you've said that, KJK, kabla ni indele kusoma social media, please remember we are giving out things and all you have to do is tell us, list for us all the drama programs that run on Y254 and do that on our social media pages. That's at Y254 on Facebook, Y254 channel on Twitter, Y254 underscore channel on Instagram. So that means if you answer today as in we'll still be looking so keep answering today tomorrow Gioni, Mustana, Sri, Asubui just whatever time but at the time we are announcing that is when we'll stop with the answers or the you know lessons yeah so again Kirudi we're asking you on our Facebook good morning good morning Nimimi, ah ah, I really like your handle, says they be attacking from behind while we attack from the front. <gasps> if you know, you know. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey, mm. hey, Matt OG says, your life, your choice. I like that. The Big Papa says, kila mtu life yake, but to me, I just can't. Nakuru well represented. I think your Xavier's cousin. Saddam Solomon says, tune in from Kakamega County. Nicking Solomon Munya, just a second. Discussion, uh, men who should be artists how wengine ni wanaume wanawake ah ah ati niko kwa nyumba kama eh ah okay ni nitajitetea during next men's conference eh actually ah good morning with joe how are you niko hata class tunana nakumis it's lifestyle see to call in another era so kila mse afanye vina ataka though for me keep piercing it's a big no for me siwezi okay kolizo the star officials is tuned ah Mugalito mesmatuni umama. Hi, Bewa Macha. I'm glad to see you this morning. Tuned up from Macha Nukwana. Hashtag is white in the morning. Remember, it's at White 5 on Facebook, White 254 channel on Twitter. And we are asking you, how do you feel about guys? And I guys, I mean gentlemen who have pierced or have braided their hair of some sort. Yeah, talk to us. So, based on Kenya Mona, Kunamta mesmatuni umama. Kuna kline? Totally, totally ni umama. <laughs> ni umama. And then Gosh. kuna ule mtu amesema, it's a lifestyle. Uh -huh. uh, but for him, it's mm -hmm. a no. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's a lifestyle. But uh, mi uangalia mi vitu like, ni kama mama labda meza. Mm -hmm. Kuna nanga venye akiwa na mtu imdogo. Mm -hmm. She's so protective nana nakaribia mtu yuake. Okay? This is a situation where pia wewe during the lifestyle, utataka tu kuifanya vyo unataka or something. But mimi kama wewe umeshuka nyueli na wewe ni mwanaume mm -hmm. na mimi niko na mtoe wangu hizi my birthday is hizi kualika oh, yeah. i do not want such Bad character influence. yeah for me that is what i feel that oh, will be an influencing my kid uh -huh. yeah sasa mtoto umekuja birthday ume gps huku yote my kid will come like eh anko amejidunga mbona how do i explain myself how na jijibu aje People are different. Just say people are different, people are raised different, but but to pendane si wote. Why is it such a big deal? Mbona unonana, kwani ni mapepo? Like, what's the, what's the problem? Asante, ni mapepo. Aji, sasa. Val, umu mtu na jayi wana mtu wa mejidunga dunga. Mini mwita batu ya mepatana. As we speak, as we speak, there are things that are happening on our, nini, there are things we would never have seen before kwa TV, but sayi tunaziona kila mahali, you know. So I don't understand why unamkataza kuona live. Will you encourage your kid to be comfortable around such people? I think everyone needs love. Everyone needs love. Eh, the only people stuck here kwe comfortable ni wenye wanaka kumpiga, <laughs> ama wanaka tu vita vita. But otherwise, I think everyone needs love. Mm. Everyone needs love and kindness. I don't care what shape, color, sexual preference you are, everyone needs love. But that's beside the point. Mom, no, Naji. Ungu, mimi, bado understand tuna chini ni lusema. Mbana ume akiamu kufanya kitu, afanyi. Juu tukianza kusema, afai kufanya hivi, afai kufanya hivi. Mm -hmm. On the other hand, madem bia tunambiwa, 
ufai kuva hivi ufai kuva hivi mm-hmm. so nasikia most of the cases mtu akirepiwa mm-hmm. wanachukwanga wanasema hapo ati alikuwa amevaa nguo fupi mm-hmm. na, na maybe hata amevaa jeans na labda hata amevaa jeans <laughs> na wanasema ati wao oh, huyu alikuwa amevaa nguo fupi mm-hmm. ndo maana akaripia alikuwa anaitisha Sa- eh, sasa unajua hiyo <laughs> mentality yenye wanaume wakakuwa nayo ati wanawake hawafai kuvaa nguo fupi mm-hmm. ndo maana wanaendanga wakirepu mtu na wanajitetea si ni ukwele hawafai kuvaa nguo fupi okay i'm glad you brought it up ukirepu mtu aimanisha <laughs> alikuwa amevaa nguo fupi hiyo ni mentality uko nayo unapata hata mtoto mdogo mbona mwanamume anarepu mtoto mdogo alivaa nguo fupi wapi na ni kamtoto hata ajui anything so hiyo ni mentality yenyewe watu wako nayo kwa hii society mtu afai kufanya hivi akifanya hivi ni mbaya but if you stand for yourself juzi nimetembea hizi streets za town wallahi okay a bit uptown ni kona mlamu mwingine amevaa short shorts short short sh- <coughs> brave move at to kid when you open up and i wear what i want by the way please just don't be fooled by just the way i look now i wear what i want but ningeva kama odem mngenisimamisha nimlaami tu kama sasa sikia why why is, is it mapaja juu tulishaona kwa poster mlaami anafaa kwa tu hivyo lakini sasa wewe wewe tunaleta mahali kwenu we want decency I don't even to the highest what, what kind of double standard that was I was in so, yani nilimwangalia na ako tu sawa na everyone around her ako tu sawa mimi ningetoa mapaja hivyo <laughs> wallolo tungerudi ancestors wangenipiga kuanzia mali nimeanza hadi <laughs> mlami si wetu tuko na idea like labda next week anarudi kwa wao but she's not female okay. anarudi kwa next but week but she's female we have the same body parts <laughs> a big rangi tu ndo tofauti mbona mko hivi Why? Yake ni nyeupe kabisa. Your double standards are insulting. <laughs> What, mbona brown skin basi? Brown 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 au brown? Mbona si vai hivyo pia? Si rangi ndio mnasema ni hivyo. Shida wanatuibianga. Sasa tunakasirika. Yeah. Unajua mlami aliwezi tuibia. Sasa ah, hiyo ah. ni mentality. Naona hiyo mentality mimi. <laughs> Get out of that mentality. Anafaa kuvaa hivyo. Ati sisi atufai kuvaa hivyo. Ah. Tofauti yetu ni gani? Si mimi ni mwanamke, ye ni mwanamke. Ako na mapaja niko na mapaja. Melanin ndio shida. Mm. Hiyo tu. No, you can't come like this. So that's therefore in conclusion, pia ufai kuambia mwanaume asipia sama asifanye kitu. Are you comfortable mwanaume akidunga ulimu? Na anadungia nini? Very much comfortable. Kuna nini anafanya? Hiyo pia ni branding. Even if it's not for branding, yeah. I said here before, if that is what you want and that is what you like, go ahead and do it. Because you're not doing it for me or for any person. Mm-hmm. Unaifanya kwa sababu imekupendeza. Mm-hmm. Hiyo ni kitu una feel nikijidunga I'm very much comfortable. Kama Saini anasema nimevaa trouser I'm very much comfortable. Na ni kama ningeva kamini dress me na, na feel uncomfortable naitoa. Lakini ju naivaa ju mimi naipenda. No one can question me for that. And Valu, for the ladies how, why do you pierce your tummy? Na mki kwanga pregnant badi na kwanga. Kwa nini wewe unabeba? <laughs> Some things that are worrying you are confusing. <laughs> I have another yeah. question. <laughs> There are types so such to take up stereotypes in there because there's this thing and I'm I'm not trying to insult anyone I'm just trying to lay facts ndo tuonge kama wakubwa ndo ndo sasa mtakuja mseme ni ma brown skin ma light skin niggas light skin guys are the ones that appears hadi poa sijui na kina Chris Brown who who more sijui ata kwa hadi na nini is that a stereotype now we follow as just because a guy wants to pierce his something he must not be light skin for you to be okay with it ndo muelewe why <laughs> eh me i think maybe ukifanya hizo vitu zote you're supposed to be on drugs i understand you kama unavuta bangi mingi <laughs> nitakuelewa ah. if maybe you are come una toka kwa family ya usani mm-hmm. maybe i may understand you uh-huh. maybe kama unatoka hii culture watu wa reggae reggae mm-hmm. eh, i always feel kama they relate see reggae is like a religion they mm-hmm. relate to their religion So I always understand you. But, But sasa tu mtu kama mimi, mm. save your maestro Mula. Mm-hmm. Niende tu niseme, nianze kuangalia Instagram, ku pierce ni pesa ngapi? Mm-hmm. Eh? Mm-hmm. Kudunga ulimi mapua ni pesa ngapi? Mm-hmm. Ati kesho nywele yangu ni mbaya. Ati mm-hmm. mvua imenyeshe nywele yangu. Sasa eh hey. Sasa pia mimi mvua ikianza tu kunyesha hivi badala nitembee kani nimejikunja hivi town na natembea nikijifunika kichwa. <laughs> Why are you saying that it is comfortable for mwana ume kushuka nywele? Hizo ni tabia gani tafadhali? Why what are you encouraging? Eh? Well, kwa watu wa ku village unaona dema amechukua besheni akieka kwa kichwa akikimbia kwa bomu. Wewe pia umeweka tu. 
Badala wewe ukimbie tu hivi, ikupige pige tu. Mwanaume ni kupigwa na mvua. Ah. Eh? Hapana. Hapana. Mwanaume no. pia alikuwa kujikaza na kutoga. Basi Sasa akifika kwa nyumba aseme, "Eh, itabidi kesho nimeenda kutoa nywele yangu." Sasa hiyo ni conversation gani? Mm -hmm. You see even ukisema kitu kama gazi be like, "Eh? Sija like, mm -hmm. sijapenda hiyo story." Mm -hmm. eh, that's that's not okay. Do you think it's a certain type of guys wana fa kufanya hizi vitu? Ati sasa either wasani ama uko light skin ama sio ufanye fa. Ama uko umetoka maju, you know being influenced. Mm, kitoka maju tutakubali. Watu wanenanga maju by the way nakutanga. Na uko unaongea kizungu. Kizungu ni. Sio unaongea tena Kiswahili tena. Kizungu ni toe. Kutoe kunarudi kwa na accent. So there actually there have been cases according to what I have heard perhaps on my research. Unastukia mtu alikuwa tu ka save ya vizuri, alikuwa na values, <coughs> morals, hafai sio kufanya nini nywele, hafai kupias. Anaenda tu maju hivi. Ha, I want to sound a bad tumbo cut bro, on a crop top. <laughs> nyuele hadi makeup you know me I won't judge anyone be free na ni life ni once Ay, once you're living you're not even living once you're dying once <laughs> you're living continuously you're dying wa once live your life so sasa utaniambia si tuseme tumejifungia sana that means tukitoka nje alafu tukutane na freedom haya unaweza fanya hivi so utachukuta umefanya vitu maisha but you see for men we, we won't judge you hata mimi nasema mabish zangu we won't judge each other mm -hmm. but tutakuwa na ile silent judgment uh, we won't be rolling with you tutakuwa na ile click tulikuwa nayo eh tutakuwa tuna ku differentiate kidogo cause tuko like ndio tukienda kwa madem wewe ndio utakuwa favorite mm -hmm. eh bishti na kuna nywele poa mm -hmm. that's why i wonder i think wanawake upoteza wanaume sana a uh a -uh. Hiyo ni fact. Nyinyi utupoteza sana kwa sababu ameshuka nyoka kwa sababu best friend ameshuka nyoka hapo. Na mimi nimenyoa watu hapo vizuri. Niko sawa, eh? Niko na t-shirt yangu ya kamatia. Ya golf. Choki na fiti dai ni kamati hapa. Sasa mmechagua tu ile jamaa wetu mwenye amebloodre nyole jana. Kamati ya. Ai. Naija, naija people. Hiyo ni kamati ya. Sasa mali unaenda. Stay easy views na feeling yenu uko ndani. Mimi I'm saying from reality what always happens. Yes. Hiyo ni Le kamati. Yaani kama mtu aomoke abaye dima, <laughs> alafu mbaki hapo na hiyo nini mlikuwa mnasukuma sukuma nayo. Alafu useme huu sasa mbona natumalizia wastana? Eh? Mbona libai gari? Eh, I like your friends dreads. Eh. They really look nice. Kai, eh. na ni safi. Hizo ni nini? Hizo ni tabia gani? <laughs> kamati ya bro. <laughs> sasa hizo mimi nimetoka kwa kinyozi yangu so jana nimenyoa vizuri. Haujani notice. <laughs> pia wewe ah why you annoyed na mimi nikishuka mtasema na kaa mbaya sasa nifanye umeshuka ukajaribu <laughs> aje sasa ni after two weeks kama mwanaume kabla anyoe anafikiria anga kwanza ushuke kama <laughs> eh shuka anakaa mbaya tutasema hujajaribu <laughs> sijaribu <laughs> jaribu jaribu sasa after week ah si hata lazima ikuwe hivi ngoja tunywele tu make dogo alafu ongeze kuna kuna nywele inakanga dread umeka tu utest extension eh utest test kama hiyo ndio roka inasema and then if you feel good continue but what about kama nitafanya hizo vitu alafu familia nikatai why would your family refuse you because of your hair They've never seen anybody doing that. They love a perception in any bayana mimi. Na si wao mlami sasa wa confuse vizuri. Na ndatumiwa maango ya kujua ni advice. <laughs> And then mtembelee ile kijana mwambie shida. But that's a reality in the yes. in the kind of yeah. setting we live. Yeah. Eh, what happens kama ungependa mwanaume hivyo? Alafu sasa wakuje wa ku advise. Eh, lakini huyu mam, eh tumependa uko na mtu. <laughs> eh, lakini we hapa eh tutafutie mwingine kwanza tuone kama tutaweza mkubali. Eh, yeah, according to me mm -hmm. and my family, they're not like that. You go for your choice, eh? Because hapo ndo happiness yako yiko. Ju, ukipenda we umtu, maybe amujapenda na kwa sababu ya look, ya nyuele ama nini. Because tunizaona, unezapata mwana ume, tunasema amenyua haku decent. Lakini hezikana weo kwa hiyo marriage. But ule mwenye ulichuzu na filu unezakana, eh? That is what you go. Nasa mkilala nyuele zenu zinagongana tu kwa kitanda, makuche nirefu mnadungana. Sasa hizo ni nini? Because me, it's only big deal up. And I don't see anything wrong with that. Because before you choose someone, or before you say that someone is going to be a man, you will be able to do everything. You will be able to do everything. Because before you go, you will be able to do everything. You will be able to do your boyfriend. You will be able to do your parents. You will be able to do your parents. So, Mimi, I don't think hata kwa relationship unafaa kuangalia mambo ya nywele sijui makucha sijui amedunga wapi sijui ni nini angalia ile love yenye mko naye cuz hizo ni part of life 
Okay. Ukisema, love is overrated. <laughs> Kama yeye ndo love blind. kama love is yeye hata ni blind by the way <laughs> sasa wewe uko tu kwa nyumba unaambia demi yako at baby ndo style nataka kuweka next week <laughs> yeye pia anakuambia babe ukishatoa uweke hii usiweke hiyo mm-hmm. alafu pia mimi ujue yangu na kama mbaya nataka kuweka kaa hii hizo ni conversation gani Mhm. Mtasota kwa hiyo nyumba nyinyi wawili. Sasa hiyo conversation ni pesa. Hiyo hiyo. Haya wewe wanashuka na wana pesa. Sasa hiyo ni conversation gani? Watu wako na pesa. Why does it always have to be one sided? What is it? Na kama ana. Kama wako nayo si watu wa fry na nini? Hiyo si kufry. Ni utoto. Ah, pia most most of the time life is not all about money. Niza kuwa na ile kidogo but hiyo inaweza to sustain. Jo uli ulimpata akishuka hiyo nywele yake mm-hmm. au kuna afford hiyo nywele si ndiye mwenyewe anajitolea pesa mm-hmm. the same way mtaka na ye, ni pia yeye ndio atatoa hiyo pesa kwa pocket na atengenezee hiyo nywele bona dem nikimpata kinaza nywele mbona anataka pesa kwa actually i was going to no, ask you no ngoja utamuuliza pesa <laughs> sasa yeye anatoa yake na yako utamuuliza you have enough obvious kila mtu hapo atajisa sasa hizi yeye yenyewe tuko sasa hizi mm-hmm. ukangi chini ukisema ti mwanaume anafaa kunipeleka salon wewe mwenyewe unafaa kujua unafaa kwenda sana na akijitolea once in a while mm-hmm. tunasema tu ile bahati tu mm-hmm. amebamba akasema eh leo acha nipeleke bibi wangu mm-hmm. na asipojitolea will you be okay still you okay. won't complain asipojitolea mimi kama mwanamke nitakaa na bwana wangu chini nimweleze beb kuko hivi na hivi mm-hmm. unaweza sasa tunaishi pamoja sasa nywele bebe anatokea tena jina eh? bebe na change eh nisipotoa pesa mimi ni mwanaume ni kitaka kutoa naitwa bebe kuzwa mahali leo anakuzwa sita kama mnatengeneza tu nywele yenu kabla tupatane hiyo train endelee tu hivyo why should i remove money for your hair how now wow. <laughs> wewe so, tengeneza tu nywele yako unataka kutoa pesa nini na uli eh? nyumba mm-hmm. Na uli juu unaenda kutafuta mm. naweza toa mm. chakula mm. because i'm eating you are eating mm. we are supposed to eat mm-hmm. hey is now hey address you ni wewe mm-hmm. just dress yourself tengeza tu nywele yako mm-hmm. yes okay but that's a whole other thing ndio maana wanasemanga 1 plus 1 is equals to 1 eh tume meet so that we become one mm-hmm. eh mm-hmm. it is this side that this side si at this side peke yake mm-hmm. yes Okay all right we, I, I think we're about to run out of time so in conclusion what do you guys suggest we say Wachana na wanaume wenye nashuka Wachana na wanaume wenye nadunga ulimi na masikio Sawa sawa Kubali wapua Ama poa umekata pia Chukua mtu kama mimi hata wapua wachana wao Sawa sawa Leave those people Mtu anakuambia nataka kwenda blood dry wachana na yeye Mtu kitafuta mtu wa kinyozi tena ukitafuta mwanamume anaenda kinyozi ya 1000 moja watana naye tafuta wa 200 hiyo kinyozi tu ya kawaida that is now a man kuna mtu aocha ameanguka na jo kinyozi ni 50 bob yes hata kuna za 30 ni... ama 20 eh eh tafuta huyo huyo mwenye spirit ni kali hadi anasikia uchungu that is the man mimi hadi nishakuacha tu na hapa mimi ndo napatikana ambao ndo ana value watu wengine lakini ni sisi ni sisi ndo tuko tu Ah na mwenye mvua kidogo kunyesha umefunika kichwa wa chana nayo. Aya. Aya please what do you think we should say in conclusion? Kabla okay. tuende. Mm. If I can conclude this discussion tukiangalia both perspective. Okay, mwanaume anafaa kufanya yale ambayo yeye mwenyewe anafurahia ndani yake. Eh? Asiangalia ti this is that inasema nini? Cuz ukikaa chini uanze kusema this is that itaki nifanye ina hii utaenda huko tu hapo umestand tu hapo jua hata sasa hizi ukiwa na shida au uko na hiyo society siko peke yako so the moment ume move on na hiyo shida yako na ukaona umefika place fulani just be you don't look at other people what they will say or what be you and uh, kwa madem sasa mhm dem ndio ule chali unapenda hata kama see. anashuka nywele hata kama wako vipi enda kwa yule ambayo unapenda Mtu asikwambia ati huyu anashuka nywele usikae na yeye ataangaliwa vibaya kwa the community or the society that is up to you and your boy go for what you want then stand by that man if you come from a family that is so strict are you able to challenge do you want to challenge your family are you okay challenging your family i'm very much comfortable with that because i'm an adult nikishafika Niki 18 niko na id i'm an adult i know what i'm doing <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, i know what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> ah, honestly I think I was just lucky. Mimi kwetu atujai kwa na vitu sijui always ifanye hivi ama always ifanye hivi. Kitu tu mmoja mamangu tu alikosea. Alikuwa na piercing tatu kwa masikio. Tatu, si ndio? Oh, Akasema, mm, hata mimi mama nataka zako. Asema, "Pana, usipiece kwa masikio." 
Nasema okay, sawa nikatulia. Alafu nikaenda kwingine nikaona wewe wewe watu wanaweza tobo hata ulimi sijui puwa sijui wapi. The next time alikuwa ananiona ni I think 3 PSM and 1 tattoo. But either way akwai nipiga, akwai nikalisha chini akaniambia my disappointment. So I've had a very relaxed type of family. Na hata ati ati Charlie ameshuka ati oh atumtaki ama ametoka sijui wapi. I've never been told that. So it's always been about Kenya sasa mimi nataka kufanya. I think maybe you should. Lakini demo nyana na GPS PS na ombi pesa ni sawa. Kama una GPS PS na unatuomba pesa, toa hizo vitu nyume PS PS. Wacha kutuomba pesa. I think I see the root of the problem. It is money. It's money. It yeah. is money. That is it has nothing to do with how you look like nani. Clearly the root of the problem is money and we'll be talking about that I think very soon. Thank you for staying with us Manze. You could have been anywhere else but you chose to be here with us. Our white platform on Facebook, white platform channel on Twitter hashtag is what in the money. And notwithstanding, don't forget we are still giving away something nice this festive season. So all you have to do is tell us what are all the drama programs running on Y254 right now. All the drama programs running on Y254 right now. And please just keep texting. Keep Shinda tu kijibu. Keri keri tu kona wewe. Just keep Shinda tu ivo. Shinda tu ivo. By the time it is time to announce, I am quite sure if you have, you know, sent as many times as possible and your answers are correct, you are highly likely to win. Okay? So have a fantastic day. Utapatati PTAE around 2 p.m. I want you to have an amazing rest of the week. Okay? Bye. Stop saying that.